Well, it has been 18 years since Nicole Brown Simpson and Ron Goldman were murdered. A lot of people believe O.J. Simpson did it. But as Javier explains this morning, there's a new name uh, involved in this. Javi, good morning. It's pretty interesting. It is interesting indeed. Definitely a talker. Now, I know we've heard many who did it stories with regard to the murders of Nicole Brown Simpson and Ron Goldman, but none quite like this one. Why? Well, it's actually coming from a serial killer who we do know murdered at least 50 people. This is Glenn Rogers right here. He might be one of the least known serial killers, but uh, in a new documentary, his brother tells the story of how Glenn was in the same town working construction at the same time of the murders. But he also told the family he knew Nicole, was parting with her, she was rich, and he was, quote, going to take her down. So why would he do it? Well, Glenn told his brother O.J. paid him to break into Nicole's house and steal a $20,000 pair of earrings he got for her and, quote, kill her if necessary. Also, when Rogers was on death row, he admitted to the murders and knew things about the murders that only the killer would have known, including a step-by-step -step description of the exact sequence of the killings, which had eluded prosecutors and cops for some time. Now, it was after 1994 that Rogers went on a killing spree and was eventually caught. Now, at this point, there's no word on if this changes anything with regard to the case. We do know O.J. was acquitted of murder uh, in those two murders. But again, like I said, this is definitely a talker, and we'll continue to follow this case. And if anything should change, we will, of course, report that.